The Ascent Inventory Management app is a hub of a many-spoke system for an organization to achieve a 360-degree view of their operations. In this video, you will learn how inventory is not just a quantity of a product. Instead, it's a careful combination of these features, functions, and standard practices we've delivered to match your unique business. There's a broad set of use cases across lines of business from purchasing, warehouse, sales, to finance or accounting, and we've taken a simplified view for this short demo. Starting with the basics, any good inventory management system is going to give you capability to organize your stock globally across locations or get granular down to the aisle, row, rack, bin in your stock rooms and multiple warehouses. Ascent delivers this and more with our location hierarchy that features customer owned, in transit, mobile, inspection, and non inventory locations. And now let's add some stock. And before we do that, I want to call out some things on the product page that have changed. As you can see, we're now tracking things like global stock quantity, the cost of inventory, and what type of costing model your organization uses if you need that level of detail. You can also see that we have units of measure, so you can actually have a 12-pack, a 6-pack, or just sell an individual unit, and each inventory record can detail that additional dimension of inventory. So I'm going to add a 12-pack to Miami. So I simply choose this. And I'll give it a cost. If your business has exposure to FDA or you're selling expiring goods, you probably know about lot tracking. Here is a lot tracked product, which means we are going to track another level of detail for every inventory transaction. Traditionally, it's a cumbersome process to implement we make this feature very simple. You can just check this box here, lot controlled, and the interface automatically changes everywhere this product surfaces, requiring you to specify which lot you are intending to use to create that inventory transaction. Another more process focused way of bringing in inventory is to create a purchase order to your vendor. Here we can see a purchase order with delivery dates and several other fields to, you can use to report on vendor performance. On the right side, we see products that a vendor should deliver once all the agreements have been made about pricing and quantity. Now it's time to receive this last line into the system. A part of this receipt is actually giving a system a brand new lot that will travel with this inventory. So I'll give it a lot name. We know it's for mineral oil and that's our new lot. And this is our expiration date. Go ahead and save that and now we've received inventory into the system. And here is an example of just how much information we can track about the lifetime of inventory inside of a lot for say FDA or audit purposes. You can also see the lot history. Sticking with the theme, we want to show you one more type of inventory you can manage. This is a serialized medical device. Just like with lot tracking, it's a simple checkbox on the product to say that this product is serialized. And now the assets section we are familiar with shows up in Salesforce with some added functionality. As you can see, we can now tell exactly where the asset is located and its serial number. We are going to do a quick move to show that an asset has passed inspection and we're gonna move it into regular stock. So I'm gonna choose the inspection and we're just moving one and we're gonna move it into Miami. And now we have one more quantity in Miami. So as we've seen, Ascent Inventory Management is the nucleus for Operations 360, a powerful app to leverage across your organization.